guys. Happy Thursday morning. I just got to work, so I wanted to hop on here live really quick and talk to you guys about why I'm just so excited that it's a fresh new day. I was at Lori's new home last night. We had a cute little dinner date, and I recorded a podcast before then. Um, and she made us dinner and we just chatted for like three hours and had peanut butter cookies and coffee and it was just the best time ever. But this was no like mother-in-law or girl talk. This was more like personal growth, in-depth conversations that were dynamic and sometimes uncomfortable, but inspirational and action oriented. So I am coming at you with a fresh new day today with a new mindset because you know, everything is 80% mindset, 20% mechanics. Okay, so if you wake up each new day and you learn, you understand that your mindset, that new day, that fresh new day is a new opportunity to try again, to do again, to start over again, to stay consistent to be disciplined. So I am so pumped up today because I've got my little homework to do and I am just so on fire. I was listening to the Susie Orman podcast on women and money. Thank you, thank you, Lori, for suggesting it. I listened to like three or four episodes this morning on my way into work and um, cause you know, I've got like an hour commute. So I make the best of it, right? Um, and I'm listening to it and I'm just like from, from last night's inspired talk and you know, this fresh new day and this new motivated me and I get, I choose that, right? You wake up every morning and you get to choose how you feel. And from having a good night last night, consistency, right? Staying consistent in your lifestyle. I'm waking up and I'm like, yes, it's a new day. What can I do today? So I'm going to go into work. I'm going to get my little planner out. Um, and I'm going to write down the things that I want to do that I, that I need to do, but I'm going to look at it as a place where I'm going to get shit done. Like I'm on fire. I take care of business. I do this. I'm going to get serious about my life my money. Like my business is thriving online. We're, we're going to Vegas. My family is just you know amazing. We've got this home and now I've got dreams and goals. My life is changing because I've been disciplined and because I'm staying consistent. So I'm starting to see the rewards. Now it's time to get serious with that so I can align myself with my future self. Okay. The future me, the one who doesn't have a nine to five. She works for herself from home. She does all the things that she loves to do. She drops her kids off at school, at the school, at the school bus. She takes her kids to the school bus. That's my dream. Like, are you crystal clear on your dreams, on what you want to do? I'm so crystal clear about it. When, when I manifested, you know, Scott, the man of my dreams, the home of our dreams, I was so crystal clear. I wanted that green grass. I wanted a porch fence that was white. I wanted someone who was loyal and honest and hardworking, but sensitive and strong and funny. I was very clear on these characteristics. I'm very clear on my future self, what that looks like, what my routine looks like working from home. I visualized it so that I can manifest it in my reality. So your thoughts, they become things. So what are you thinking today? It's a fresh new day. What are you thinking? What do you got going on in your head? Are you so excited about what's coming up, about what you can do? Are things going wrong? Are you focused on all the problems? Be solution oriented today. Get out your planner, get out your notebook, write down the things that you have to do and turn them into a positive aspect. So for me, I've got a lot of, you know, after last night's conversation, I'm going to dive in to life and money and it's overwhelming for me because I'm starting from the bottom, but you have to be okay with being a beginner sometimes and knowing that I'm coming in as a beginner open to receiving I can get excited about all the things that I need to do next because I see the big picture of what's going to come from it. So you guys have been seeing me post a lot about health and fitness. You know, I am excited and motivated. This wasn't always me two and a half years ago. I was in an abusive relationship, right? So this, this new me, I created. You can create a new you. You have the choice every fresh new day to start again, to try again. Do you see where I'm going with this? Y'all, it's Thursday and I'm fired up. Like, I'm so excited. Um, 
so yeah, I just wanted to leave you guys with that. Oh, that's what I was saying about my health and fitness and posting, you know, every morning I do my cardio. Like that's like my thing. I missed it this morning, but that's you know, moderation. Okay. This morning I needed to sleep in. I put on the insight timer app. You know, I am a fan of that. And I put on my morning, um, meditation. I found this amazing one. It's 10 minutes when you don't want to get out of bed. Okay. And you just want to lay there for a second, grab, grab your phone, put the, put it next to you this, this 10 minute and just lay there and just lay there in bliss instead of anger or frustration or overwhelm or disappointment that you have to go and do the next thing. Have a meditation where you can go out of bed, get out of bed excited before your feet even hits the floor. You get to choose that. So I've been waking up and doing my morning cardio 30 minutes. That's I give myself my brain in the morning loves it. Like my day is so fresh and awesome and motivated and empowered because I spent those first 30 minutes on me first. I filled my cup up first. So I'm starting to see the results. Like my pictures, like I'm like, I'm feeling good. We just got back from vacation. I'm seeing the reward of my consistency and my discipline. I'm seeing that instead of going to Chevy's next door for lunch, I I bring my lunch and, and I and I pack it. So this whole life and money thing and the up leveling that is about to come, I am so excited. If you guys are interested in what I'm doing and maybe you know we can work on this together, I am like such a fan of we are better together. So if you're going through kind of the same thing, then let's do it together, please. Um, two and a half years ago when I left and I started sharing my story online, I started talking to people in Facebook Messenger, just chatting back and forth, making new friends. And it was the greatest thing because when women get together, we become a powerhouse for each other. When women empower other women, we become a force that is undeniable. So if you're going through something like this or you wanna you know, kind of join me in this you know, life money trans transformation, send me a message. Let's open up a group chat. Let's do it together. Um, so yeah, I'm so excited for today. Fresh new day to try again, to start again, to be disciplined, to get disciplined, to be consistent. So I hope you guys have an awesome Thursday and I will chat with you later.